So yes, hello everybody, this is Ray from Race United. I've got some exciting news for you, but before we continue, I want you to know we did it. We've hit 1,000 subscribers and counting in three months of YouTube. And um, thanks to everybody that subscribed to my channel. And this is so important to me that each and every subscriber matters to me. I really wanted to do a competition. Unfortunately, I couldn't do it. So what I'm going to do now is to ensure that um, the 2K, the road to 2K will definitely be on. And before we hit it, or by the time we hit it, the competition will be explained properly. And whoever wins will get a Manchester United shirt. Whether you're a female or a male, you will get a Manchester United shirt. However, that's a long way to go. So right now, what I need to do is to actually tell you that, look, I've got something I need to discuss, and it's very important, is to do with Pi. And so if you're one of those that is in doubt of Pi, this is where I need you to calm down and then just pay attention and listen because I've got something coming up. I know certain people are in doubt and I, I understand. Look, we live in a world of so many scumbags here and there. So please, I get it. I get it. So yes, uh, yes, Saeed, I've hit, I've hit 1K, man. You haven't checked. I hit 1K a few days ago. So yeah. Uh, you're important to me, Said. All you people, all your, my subscribers are important to me. So whoever subscribes, a little contribution they give, whether it's coming to watch my live um, um, shows or even just simply having a peek for two, three, four, five minutes before, you know, going away, I really appreciate that. So, yes, thank you so much. I've hit 1K uh, the last few days. I think it was on the 24th, which is on uh, Wednesday. That's when I hit my um, 1K. So right now, I think I'm at uh, uh, 1,080 or so, something like that. So yeah, it's uh, it's growing. It's growing. And uh, I'm glad that I may be doing something right, which I, I still think, um, you know, I've got lots to learn because I, um, I just started this YouTube channel. So yes, shout outs to everyone that helped uh, with the growth of the channel. And I'll never forget anything that all of you have done, including Albert, of course. My brother from another mother, Albert. He is the main, main contributor from this channel. So another shout out to him. I don't know if you've been watching my other videos. You can see that when I give a shout out, he's one of the first people whose names are mentioned, especially when I give the special thanks. Um, thank you all. And I really appreciate that. But today, after the announcement I've already made, that I've hit the 1K. My main goal now is to ensure that I get people on this bandwagon called the Pi Network. I've been trying to get people on it, especially via YouTube, but it seems to be something that YouTubers or people that subscribe to my channel have a little doubt in it. And I know, I understand the doubts because, you know, when you don't know something, it's very difficult to actually understand what's going on. So today, what I'm going to do is to just break it down to the basics, because if you want to get people to understand, you will break it down to the basics. Now, Saeed, uh, to <laughs> What are you talking about? <laughs> you don't want to win Manchester United shirt. No, thank you. Well, if you, if you win, you will get the shirt, whether you like it or not. You will get it. So don't worry about it. This is the Man United channel. Well, partly Man United channel, but mainly Man United channel. So if you win it out of the thousands of people, you're going to get it, unfortunately. But that's down the, down the line. Not now. Not now. Now let's just focus on what's at hand. And what's at hand right now is my Pi Network thing. So I'm going to um, immediately, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go and then uh, bring it up on the screen because it's very um, difficult to explain it when I'm using words. But when people come in, it's very easy. You understand? So, uh, sorry, when I bring the screen up, it's going to be very easy for people to understand what I'm actually talking about. So, um Give me a moment and I'll be back. Just I'll, I'll still be on screen. I'm not leaving. I'll still be on screen. So don't worry. While I check out the, the, the pie to bring it onto the screen. And when you see it, you'll understand what I mean. You know, you will understand what I mean. So, yeah, um, I think it's on the screen now. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to set it up and then share the screen. Um, which one is it? So I'm going to share this one. 
then you are going to see it on your screen. So yeah, it's on your screen now. Uh, I hope so. Yep, it's on your screen. So yeah, you can see it right there. The pie is on your screen. So um, I've made it bigger. I'm going to actually just put it there, remove my face from there. You know, so you lot, and then I'm going to remove, I'm going to hide that and remove the invitation code from there so that everybody would understand everything I talk about. Right. So if you look here, what you're seeing is the screen of Pi. That is the screen of Pi. You're seeing that, right? So when you, just hang on a minute, because I've got a lot of lecture to give right now. Lots of lecture to give in the next 30 minutes or so. So I need people to just hang on there and wait for me to do my thing. All right. So Pi Day is coming, but I'm going to talk about that later. For now, what I'm going to talk about is just the basics of Pi. And before that, let me give you background into cryptocurrency. So back in the day, banks, you know, uh, still, banks are like um, our sharks. You know what I mean? They take our money, they enjoy our money and everything. But when it comes to like, you know, um, us getting back from them, it, it becomes very, very difficult. So what crypto, when, what cryptocurrency brings us is that they ensure that we are able to have control or take control of our currency. You the currency what? brings oh, us oh, is oh, that. Oh, 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 hang on. They, uh, right. So I, I just one of my things. So, yeah, it, it, it ensures that we have um, control of our currency, you know, and it, it, the value of it can fluctuate based on its popularity. So it's just like being on the stock market. So if you're in the stock market and the value of um, your stock is high, it means the demand is high. You understand what I mean? So in this case, if the demand of a cryptocurrency is high, you're going to get a higher value of it. You're going to get a higher value. And if the value is high, then what do you get? See? So that's the thing. So what you need right now is to get a higher value. You get what I mean? A higher value. And so it's very important that we know that. You get what I mean? A higher value is so important. So that's why Pi, well, let me see. Okay, because I have a lot of respect for you. If I win. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Said, I'll just bring this up because you said that. Just a digression. It's a live show, so I'm going to be interrupted a lot. And I, I don't really care about that. I really care about whoever chats. <laughs> yeah, okay, because I have a lot of respect for you. If I win, I will wear it. That's a promise. Well, thank you so much, Said, And I appreciate that. That is an appreciation. And I dare you too. If you wear it, wonderful, 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 Said. So, yes. So as I was saying, um, with Pi, what you're going to see is you're going to get like, um, you, you, you're going to get this cryptocurrency. No, no, no. Let me just go back because remember I said background. So what happened was Bitcoin, Bitcoin came into play, into play. When they came into play, that was like uh, when? Uh, 12 years ago, they came into play, 2009. When they came, just like this Pi, people were in doubt. They were like, what the hell is this? We don't know what this is. What the hell is this? And then the ones that mined it then obviously requires a lot of energy. So it means that you have all these plants where high amounts of energy is being going on for you to for you to mine your pie. In this case, what happened was the ones that did it earlier were able to amass so much Bitcoin. So so once Bitcoin's mining stopped, the demand was high, the price started going up slowly, and people started paying attention. They're like, gosh. This thing is really kicking on. And so when it kicked on, people realized that, goodness me, I've got to get on the bandwagon. But by the time they got on it, what happened? It was too late. It was too late. So you don't want it to be too late. So this, but then again, Pi came in. Like I said, I've been talking about my, in my other videos about the background of Pi and blah, blah, blah. But this time I'm going to break it down into some understanding. So when you get on the bandwagon, you will now not be in doubt. You understand what I mean? You will not be in doubt. So what you're seeing on your screen is my pi, the one I have. That's my account. So you're seeing 15,477 and a bit of pi. That's what I have. You understand? So pi at the moment has not been monetized. It's not been given value yet. But once it's given value, what you're going to get is whatever the value is multiplied by 
what you have, what you've mined. You see? So that's why I've been trying to get people on the bandwagon. A lot of people, obviously, understandably, are doubtful. And I understand that. But me, I am not in this business to try and um, double cross people. I'm trying to get people into the bandwagon so that when the mining stops, which is going to stop before the end of this year, that's why I'm really onto this. Otherwise, I wouldn't have even talked about it. But once it stops, people wouldn't be able to mine anymore. Now you'll have to buy it. You'll have to buy it. You have to buy it from people like me. And if I see that the value of pie is going up, I'm not going to sell it, which means that you find a problem with it because now because you are trying to buy it i'm not selling it i'll say all right it's like we're doing a bargain so you know the, the markets would be like hmm, okay the value is going up then so it goes up a bit it goes up a bit by the time you realize you're left behind that's what's happened to those of us that didn't get on the bitcoin bandwagon that's why i'm trying to get people involved in this so um let me just before i continue I'm going to uh, do something very quickly and then, um, yes, so just hang on a minute for me, please. Hang on a minute for me. Yes. Okay. And then hang on a minute for me. I'll be there very soon. Just one minute, please. I'll be there very soon. Yep. So, uh, all right. So, yeah, it's happening. All right. So, Pi, yes. So, as I was saying, this is something that I'm trying to get a lot of people involved. It's so important to me. You understand? And People don't even understand why I'm trying to get them involved. Now, why am I trying to get them involved? Because this is something that um, is going to kick on at the end of the year. And once it does kick on, people are going to be scrambling for scraps. And you don't want to be scrambling for scraps. So without further ado, I'm going to take you straight into Pi. I'm going to take you straight into Pi. And once I take you there, you're going to understand what's happening. You get me? You're going to understand what's happening. All right. So I'm going to show you um, what's happening right now. Okay. So what you need is the link. So the link is what you're seeing. Oh, hang on a minute. The link is what you're seeing on the bottom strip. So you see the ticker over, over there at the bottom of your screen, the blue ticker that is your link so you can see the mine pi.com forward slash ray k and then the invitation code is ray k 79 i'm going to change the radiant uh, the gradient to um purple because obviously let me go a bit dark because pi is uh purple yep so i've changed the gradient to that so that's a perfect color for pie. Perfect color for pie. So the gradient is now purple because we're talking about pie. So now what I'm trying to get you to do here is to understand the fact that pie is here to stay. And because it's here to stay, I want a lot of people, as many as possible, to get involved. I will be showing you a bit of my screen, but for security reasons, I might not show you everything on my screen because I don't think it's advisable for me to do that. So what I'm going to show you is what you're going to see the cursor running over. So once you get on it, you're going to see um, a prompt, which is going to tell you to enter the uh, uh, the person that invited you's um, invitation code. So you get the invitation code, whatever it says. Once you get it, you um, um, put it through and then you're able to get on board that. You will see a screen like this. So once you get onto this screen, what you're going to first do is to go to the menu. And when you go to the menu, you scroll down to profile. And when you click, click on profile, um, you're going to see this. So when you see that, when you see that, you see? So if you look here, you can see all of that, right? 
let me just move this up a bit. Okay, I'm going to go back. Okay, profile. So here, you can see that I'm all set. You can see everything. And so what you're going to see, you're going to have your username. You're going to have your um, invitation code. And this is the referral link. So it's right there. And then obviously the settings. So all of that, the password, everything is there. And then when you go back there, if you don't understand anything, you go straight to the white paper or the frequently asked questions. What I would say is that go to the frequently asked questions because when you go to the frequently asked questions, you will be able to see what's happening. You understand? So the frequently asked questions, obviously you're going to see questions like pi is not free money. So pi is not free money. It's a long-term project whose success depends on the collective contribution of its members. And then what is pi? Pi is a new cryptocurrency for and by everyday people that you can mine or earn from your phone. Now, why are we using the phone and not going the Bitcoin routes? Because the Bitcoin routes, it's become uh, uh, um, unaf unaffordable and uh, unrealistic for certain people. But if you look at this one, what you're seeing here is an affordable one. However, however, now this is where the, 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 the catch is. You will have to mine every 24 hours, not all 24 hours, every 24 hours. So you're going to be reminded. I'll talk about that later. So you can see it's is this real? Is Pi a scam? Pi is not a scam. It's a genuine effort by a team of Stanford graduates to give everyday people greater access to cryptocurrency. If you want to read more, you click on it, you get more to read. And then how does this app work? How do I earn more Pi? You understand? So everything is there. Um, do I have to, you know, do I need to leave the app open to mine? Now, this is very important. Does the app drain my battery or data? This is very, very, very important. So I want you to know this. You do not need to leave the app open to mine. You understand? Mine means to earn, to earn the pie like you're mining gold. And then pie does not affect your phone's performance, drain your battery, or use your network data, unlike other cryptocurrencies. You understand? So once you, once you hit the lightning button, which is the green one you're going to see on the screen when I put it up, you can even close the app and you will continue to mine, which is earn pie. You get what I mean? So there are so many things going on that you should understand with this. If you don't do that, what's going to happen is you're going to find yourself um, still being on Pi, but you're not earning anything. Now, the main thing that's going to ensure that your mining rates, now I'm going to show you everything. So you come here. If you look on this screen, I'm going to show you something. So if you look on this screen, hang on a minute. So if you look on this screen, you can see you've got a chat. I'm not going to show you that. You've got the security. You've got the um, the members that I have are 56 people, of which 15 are at the active at the moment. And then this is the mining rate. So the 15 people that are mining are ensuring that my mining rate is 0 0.93. If those 15 people don't mine, I'm going to have only 0 0.25, uh, um, 0 0.25 uh pi per hour which is not a lot so you'll have to invite people yourself because i only gain from the people i invite the people that use my um, invitation code that's the people i benefit from i don't benefit from anybody else so that's how you're gonna benefit you get what i mean and if you do that i guarantee you you are going to earn your pie now my pie at the moment you can see it's fifteen thousand. this is over one and a half years fifteen thousand. let me go back shouldn't be doing that it's 15,477 and a bit. Now, imagine, this is this is where the card, the Trump card is. Imagine if this 15,000 turns to money. For instance, let's say pi starts at $1. So if it starts at $1, what are you going to see? $15,477. However, it doesn't mean I'm going to spend that. I'm going to wait for pi's popularity to go up. And once it keeps going up, what's going to happen? That value there is going to increase. That's why I believe that if people join this bandwagon, they're going to enjoy the fruit of it. You understand what I'm saying? So this is so important to me. It's very important that I get a lot of people involved. Um, when I joined Pi, uh, sorry, when I joined Pi, obviously somebody invited me. And right now, uh, over the past, I think I slacked a bit a year ago. I didn't really invite a lot of people. 
And then as time went on, when they announced the dates and everything, and I got sure of it, I thought, you know what? I can get people to join it now. You know, I can get people to join it because then I know there is a, a light on the, at the end of the tunnel. You understand? And since there is light at the end of the tunnel, I believe people should or, or could join in and enjoy everything that's happening. And then, of course, there is the, um, the white paper. Now, the white paper is very technical. So if you're not technically savvy, um, this is going to just beat your mind a lot. Trust me, it's going to beat your mind because it's, uh, it's a very interesting kind of thing. So I don't like showing people that. But if you're interested, you can go there. The main thing I like showing people is the FAQs, the frequently asked questions, because this is where you get most of your answers. You get me? So right now I'm going to show you my face because I think I've hidden enough. So you're going to see my face. Yeah, this is my face. So yes, again, my name is Ray, and this is Ray's United, and my channel keeps growing. Oh yes, 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 my friend Saeed. Uh, sorry, um, uh, <laughs> you know I'm gonna come back to you. I'm, I'm just, uh, I'm talking, so your names just skip me. But yeah, Sohail, Sohail, yes, my friend Sohail, uh, Mr. Afridi. All right, so let's continue. So as I was saying. If you look at this, what you're going to see is um, I answered a few questions, the questions that people might be having. Um, so do I need to leave? Yes, yes, yes. So this one is, why do earlier members mine at a higher rate? Now, this is a very good, good question. So this is a question that somebody would ask. Why do earlier members earn or mine at a higher rate? Now, earlier members mine at a higher rate to reward contributions, you understand, to the network when, oh, sorry, uh, yeah, to reward contributions to the network when they are most needed. You get what I mean? So it's it's one of those that is so important. And then eventually, I'll keep doing these over and over and over in different forms where I'll be able to go into the, the technicalities of it. But for now, what I'm trying to do is to ensure that people understand what we're doing here. You know, people need to understand what we're doing here because... I'm not just here trying to blab about, oh, yeah, pie is this, pie is that, because no, I'm not selling. I'm actually trying to get you on the bandwagon of this. You understand? So I've spoken a bit about um, the basics of the network. I mean, the basis of the pie network. Now I can get into um, the pros and cons. So, well, obviously the pros, I can talk, this is just from me, my perspective, especially the pros and cons. So I would say, the pros, uh, let me just talk about a little bit of the pros. So the pros, the first one I'll talk about is the fact that it's very flexible and you're able to use your phone with it. I mean, everywhere you go, you have it with you as long as... And the thing is, people think you have to have data all the time, especially with people from uh, other countries where they don't get as much data as we in the UK and other first world countries get. However, you don't need so much data because what you need is a little data to be able to... Um, uh, uh, get yourself active. So once you get yourself active, you're able to, you know, ensure that you're active. So you go straight to the cloud. So you don't need to keep your data on after you've gotten yourself active. But you need your data on to get yourself active. And that will be after every 24 hours. Now, if you're in my team, I would always remind you because I send, I ping everybody uh, at once. So you would receive, receive a notification that, Oh, you need to uh, mine, and then straight away you go, you mine, and then that's it. You forget about it for 24 hours, you get another ping from me, and then you do the same thing. If I forget, you ping me, and then, you know, I, I, I get reminded. So, hey, that's what we do. That's what I do in the team. So that's one of the pros. The second pro, which probably will be very important, is the fact that it's, it's got this simplistic nature about it. It's very, very simple. You know, you look at the interface, it looks good. You look at the setup, you go to the menu, everything is clear. And I love that fact, you know, the fact that sometimes certain technical stuff are very difficult to understand. But with this one, there isn't much to not understand. You understand? Um, they're, they're very easy to, 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 to um, understand. And so when you get there, the first thing, like I said, go straight to the menu and click on the frequently asked questions. But those are questions you're going to have. You understand? Those are questions you're going to have. So if you have questions, you go straight there and you start answering them. That's where you're going to benefit from. I never really asked a lot of questions from uh, to the team in the developers chat group because I've always read this, read this 
you know, end, from beginning to end. And I've read the um, the uh, what's the name the uh, uh, white paper as well. I've read that uh, cover to cover, so I understand how Pi works. I may not be able to impart it clearly to you because there's so much technicalities going on. Even me and myself, sometimes I find it difficult and I don't want to be technical either. I've watched some other YouTube channels where they talk about Pi, but they're very technical. I don't want to get there because if you're too technical, people don't understand what you're saying. You know, I, I am um, an electronic engineer by profession, but I don't talk to people in, in an electronic engineering uh, language. I speak a normal Queen's English. You understand what I'm saying? So I don't talk like that. You know, so I, I'm trying to break it down to each and every person to understand that there is nothing to fear when it comes to Pi. It's very, very simplistic. The third pro is the core team are accessible. You know, now I'm going to show you something. When you go to the chat, you can see there are different chats here. So there is the English, general English chat. There's the pioneers. We are pioneers because we're on Pi. There's the developers chat. There's a node. I don't want to go into that. There's a brainstorm. I don't want to go into that. But if you look at the first three, the general English, the pioneer English, and then the developers. I normally go to developers when I have questions. Now, when you go there, you're going to get lots of answers from the moderators. And then sometime during the day, that's when in Los Angeles time, when um, Dr. Nicholas Kokalis is awake or active, he would also get on board and in part is not whatever he he knows and and certain answers to some questions you understand so you get all of that they're there for you to have conversations with you understand they're not just some some hidden uh developers you understand what i'm saying so that's the the, the third pro i mean the third advantage to having pi do i have a fourth one because everything is from my head i'm not actually um um reading from anything so you know everything is in my head uh let me see the the fourth one could be the fact that you can invite anybody <laughs> maybe that you can invite anybody to join pi and that is the main thing you can invite anybody as long as you have a mobile phone and that person has a mobile phone a smartphone to, to be clear you can invite them they use the product uh, the um invitation code and there they go they'll be on pi let me just show people the invitation code so that it becomes much easier. Uh, where is the invitation code? Oh, I just removed that. The invitation code is that. So in case everything is not clear, this is my invitation code. You understand? So when you join Pi, this is what you're going to see. You get me? And just, you know, join it and see what it takes you. Because when you're there, you never know. You never know. But the thing is, something that you don't know, how do you want to judge it negatively? No, first get to know it, understand it, and then you be like, all right, you know, I think I get it now. Or, nah, I'm not a fan of it. You know what to hell with this. I, I don't want to do anything with it. Simple. So just do that. Don't judge it right from the beginning because I didn't do that. It, when, when, when I was invited, the first thing I did was I went straight away, signed up, and then understood it by reading the FAQs. And then from then on, I said, you know what, I'm, I'm on this bandwagon. And since then, I haven't looked back. Now, by the end of this year, we're gonna have, we're gonna know how much our, um, uh, what's the name of it? Our Pi coins are gonna be worth. You understand? So we're gonna know how much our Pi coins. This one, I'm gonna know how much this one is going to be worth. See, it's very important. This is what the best, if not one of the best. It is the best mobile cryptocurrency available this is it the rest are all copycats that's what i'll say this is it they pioneered it and they've named us the contributors pioneers you know we are the pioneers as long as you, you the first thing you do when you sign up you, you become a pioneer and then from then on you, you become a contributor and so on and so forth you know so there's a lot of things going on in pi i don't want to talk too much so i can only tell you this and then when you join, you will know what kind of team this is. If you want to know how many people are active, now this is it. Not the ones whose pies are going to be burned, but they're active ones, the active ones. We have about 13 million plus active pioneers or active members. You understand? So when you join, you've joined a whole family of worldwide people. 
they're all diverse. There are no uh, people coming from one country. They're coming from all over the world, the corners of the world. You understand what I'm saying? So it's very important to know. You see? And yes, my friend MSK Afridi said, Pi could be a new Bitcoin in the future. Absolutely. I am very certain of it. I was certain before, but now I'm absolutely certain. You understand? Before I was like, eh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I was just on it. I was on it. But now I'm really on it. And so my friend Afridi, if you're there, you know that I believe in that. And I know you believe in that. So we are going to ensure that Pi kicks on. Now, all of you that have joined, remember, you can't just join and just be there and thinking that being a sole member in your own team is going to work out for you. That's one thing I need to let you know. I'm not going to gain from your team. The only thing I'm going to gain from is uh, uh, from you. You, not from your team, from you. That's who I'm going to gain from. So when you invite people and the people use your product code, they're going to gain from, so you're going to gain from them. So that's what I'm trying to say. You need to invite people for yourself. Because the one thing I wouldn't want to see is that we go into the main net, which is going to happen very soon, probably uh, just before the end of this year, which will come very soon. And then once we're there, you'll be like, oh, gosh, I should have invited more people to have earned a lot more pies. Do it now. So your, your, your um, pie rate or your mining rate will be higher. That way you can amass a lot more pie coins. Because if you don't do that, you're not going to amass a lot. You would have been here for more than whatever, how, however long you've been here, but you will not amass a lot. You understand what I'm saying? So I would entreat you to, while you're on the bandwagon, get people involved. Let them tag along. You know, don't just be the only person trying to enjoy this. Let them tag along too. And let them let someone tag along because it's not a pyramid scheme. I don't gain from the people you invite. I only gain from you. You understand? I only gain from you. So if you're not um if you're not active I only what I try to do is I ping everybody and then they uh, when they're there they 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 come active do you know what I mean so I really am on this pie thing and to be honest I, although my channel is a you know, generally football channel I'm evolving so when I started I started with something else I changed the name became race united I went into football I realized you know I can do other things so I'm doing football now. So, so I'm doing football and other things. And pie is like in my heart. Do you know what I mean? Because I can feel it. And you, when you can feel something, you want people to be involved. You don't want to be selfish. I'm not going to say, oh, I've got um, 55 members, including myself, making it 56. So I'm okay. You can't be satisfied. You need to keep going. You cannot be satisfied. And I'm not satisfied because I need people. I need people to be involved. Do you know what I mean? I need people to be a uh, part of this whole um, evolution. Do you know what I mean? So, yes, everyone knows that. It's not a pyramid scheme. And so because it's not a pyramid scheme, that's why I'm happy about it. And the, the, the transparency from the uh, core team is something that's paramount to me. So because of that, I'm even more convinced that this thing is going somewhere, it's going places. And people are beginning to join. At the latter stages, of course, at the latter stage, they're beginning to join. But it's all good. It's better being on it now than not being on it at all. So I'm glad that at least it's hitting the note, it's hitting a certain note, and people are beginning to listen to the song I'm singing. Do you know what I mean? Or the music I'm playing. So, you know, I'm glad that people are beginning to realize. And I'm happy. I'm happy because, you know, I've got a few people involved. Some people have helped me get certain people involved. And it's something that I want to continue, you know, till the day we they say we're in the mainnet now. You know, it's going to be. Uh, 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 marketable. It's going to be uh, be on the exchange where you can exchange and make some money. You know what I mean? Because the other day, um, uh, the founder, he did a lecture. You can go to YouTube and check the uh, channel. He did a lecture on blockchain and it was so clear. That's when I understood exactly what he's trying to do. I understood everything. Before, I never really understood it, even though I knew the basics. I never really got it, but I knew that you know we were going somewhere. But now, after I watched that lecture that he gave his um, Stanford students on YouTube, oh, sorry, he gave it and then he posted it on YouTube for us, the pioneers, to see. Okay. Transparency doesn't come any better than that. You know, so I need all of you, those of you that are on my channel, the YouTube channel, to subscribe, sorry, to us. I'm so used to subscription, to um, get yourself on the bandwagon of Pi 
because trust me, when because I'll still be here when Pi is kicked on and become uh, uh, a success, I'll still be here because my YouTube channel is here to stay. It's going nowhere. However, while I'm here, I want to see others also on the bandwagon and enjoying it. You understand? Because if you don't enjoy, if you don't join it, and we all enjoy it, you're just there lagging. You know whose fault is it going to be? And finally, um, what did I want to say? Uh, I didn't want to say much, but what I wanted to say is that I, I want to thank everyone that's helped my channel grow to 1,000. I said in the beginning, I'm going to say it again. I'm very, very happy that people have helped channel grow and they're still helping. I've got family members, I've got friends, I've got people I don't know, people I've, I've met on Facebook. Um, they're all helping the channel grow. And so I want to say this here and now. I'm very happy. And I want the channel to keep growing and growing and growing. It takes a lot of work. You know, it's hard work, but people are helping it grow. So I am not going to sit by and, you know, uh, sit on my laurels and do nothing. So if you're here right now watching me, thank you so much for helping the channel grow. And it's going to grow some more. I'm very confident about that. And it's always going to be with your help, not anybody's, your help. So thank you very much and peace.